I'm Keith Helwig, the author of Morning Will Come and No Place Like Home. This week, due to the efforts of police departments, two tragic events were circumvented. The first I'd like to address is that of the serial bomber in Texas. Through the determined efforts of investigators and police officers, the identity of the bomber was discovered. I'm not going to honor this cowardly individual by even mentioning his name, but it was through the actions and the integrity and the doggedness of these officers that he was found and that the situation was resolved. Whether the person took his own life or whether his life was taken by the police officers on the scene is something I don't know, but to me it's something that's irrelevant. This person was choosing to terrorize his community and his state, and action needed to be taken. The second tragic event, which was circumvented by law enforcement, occurred at the Great Mills High School in the state of Maryland. This tragedy was stopped by De Deputy Blaine Gaskill of the St. Mary County Deputy Sheriff's Department. Deputy Gaskill heard shooting in his school and rather than hiding behind a pillar outside of the school, went into the school, confronted the killer, and in an exchange of gunfire, the young man was killed. There's no mention in the media whether the young man was armed with a rifle or with a handgun. It doesn't matter. What matters is that Deputy Gaskill, through bravery, through integrity, and through honoring his badge and his duty, took action. Through the actions of Deputy Gaskill, perhaps many lives were saved. It's unfortunate that the young man was killed. Again, I will not mention his name. I will not give him the notoriety that he perhaps desired. I will mention the name of Blaine Gaskill. Deputy Gaskill should serve as an example to all officers out there as someone who did his job without hesitation and helped to stop a tragic situation. If I were able to meet him, I would like to extend my personal thanks to him. To my audience, if you're watching my videos on YouTube, I'd like to ask that you please hit the red subscribe button. To do so allows me to continue to make my voice heard and to help make your voice heard. Thank you, stay safe, and watch your back.